In this video, I am going to show how to use a script I created to evenly distribute any number of vApps containing linked clone desktops among any number of destination data stores. In this environment, I have four hosts connected to a shared NFS and four local data stores, one on each host. The VMs in the parent vApp are all in the NFS data store, but I want the linked clones to write on the local data store and only use the NFS for reads, as the parent VMs will stay there. Here you can see the content in each data store. Now we will run the rebalance linked clones script and see the result. The script takes three obligatory and one optional arguments. They are vapp root name, which is the root name of the vapps we want to distribute, destination data stores, which is a comma separated list of data store names, and n and start n, which are the highest and lowest number in the range of vapps we want to distribute. By default, start n is 1, and it is the optional parameter. The script will display what it will try to do and ask for confirmation. Once you press Y it will proceed with the job. After a few minutes the rebalance is completed. Now we can see that all the linked clone VMs are in the local data stores while keeping the parent VMs in the NFS. If we check the vSphere client, we will see that each linked clone VM is now using two data stores. That is, because the parent VM disks are on the NFS. We can now power on these linked clones. The script will stop. If you provide a wrong vApp name, or if you provide any wrong data store name. Or if you try to migrate vApps that are powered on. The script will not try to migrate a linked clone VM if you try to use a destination data store that is not connected to any host that also sees the source data store. Or if the destination data store is the source data store. The script can also be used to move the vApps back to the NFS or to move them wherever you want. Thanks for watching.